Hello, good morning on this beautiful morning for all of you. I am here for you again for this video tutorial, short one. It is all about Huawei P20 Lite or some other Huawei smartphone on MUI uh, 9.1. And today I am showing you how to enable developer options and how to disable it. And as a bonus tip, how to show all the touches on your screen. And this video also includes this video also, which is how to access the settings of your smartphone, if you do not know already. Um, and this video can be found down below in the description below this video. And let's start, shall we? Come on. In this video I will be using settings of my smartphone. In several ways how to open settings you can find in one of my previous videos, which you can find in the description below this video. So first is how to check if developer options are even enabled. To check that it is very simple. First I will just tap on the setting shortcut on my home screen. This menu pops up, scroll up until you get to the system, tap on it to open it. Down here, near the user experience improvement, if your developer options are enabled, it will show developer options just above it. But in my case, it is not there, so developer options are disabled. How to enable developer options? It is simple. On this same menu, just go up to About Phone and tap on it to open it. And here, just start tapping on Build Number 7 times until you get notification you are now a developer. Just few moments ago you saw black screen. The moment developer options were enabled, capture program of the screen did not capture anything on the screen. It just went dark. But my screen stayed on all the time. Now when developer options are enabled, I will just go step back by pressing arrow into the left. On this menu, down here, where we previously did not saw developer options, now it, it is. And when I tap developer options, I see all the different settings that I can change. But be careful what settings you are using. Some settings can make your phone do strange stuff, <laughs> if you do not know what you are doing. Now it is time for me to show you in two different methods how to turn off developer options. First one is directly from the developer option menu. On the top here, if you click on the switch, it will turn off developer options and it will put you back to the system menu. For the second method, I will just tap on the left arrow near the system. Now let's tap on the apps, now tap on the apps. So here we need to find an app named settings. To do this we can either just scroll up and find the settings, but easier way is just to click here in the search tab, start typing settings and here it is settings. Just tap on it to open it. So here we have what we can do with this app. Now we need to click storage. Now tap on clear data and tap on delete. Now it will just bring you back to the home screen. Settings data are deleted. That means the developer options are disabled, but your phone settings and application settings and such, all of this will stay like it is. It will no change. But developer options will be disabled. But to check if the developer options are really disabled, now I can just go back into the settings, tap on the system, and down here we do not see developer options anymore. 
So now I will just go in through the process of enabling the developer options back again because I want to show you as a bonus tip of the day how to show all the touches on your screen. To do this I need to open developer options which I did just now and here just scroll up until you find the switch for show touches under the input. Click on it and all the touches will be shown. So that was it for today. I hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, did not understood something whatsoever, just type everything below this video in the comment section. And last thing for today, I just want to say thank you for watching. If you want to get notified about new videos, of course, subscribe. Click bell icon to get notified about new videos, of course. Select all notifications. Yeah. <laughs> uh, if you like the video, give big thumbs up. If you did not, you know, thumbs down and share with others so others can learn also. And until next time, have a blast people and see ya. Bye bye.